Well, the first thing I would say, the only thing that any of us as political representatives or anybody else needed to say about the Irish women's soccer team is that they are an amazing group of young women who did our country and nation absolutely proud. Um, in respect to Steve Baker and Ireland... And as their Ireland, manager acknowledged, caused some hurt. With I, and I, understand, I understand that you need to um, be cognizant. And there's people in different positions. Um, so all of us have an obligation to ensure that our words or our actions don't cause um, hurts to um, victims of the conflict. Um, um, I'm not sure of the value of us pointing fingers at young people who are having a sing-song in a pub um, brings about. And I certainly don't know the value of Steve Baker and um, um, Arlene Foster, who should have more important things to worry about, I have to say, um, considering that the institutions um, okay. um, are on a stalemate and because of the huge devastation that Brexit has caused. And as we approach the month of November, when we will be inundated with um, tributes and commemorations and celebrations of the British Army, and not a word will be um, will be spared for or a All thought right. for the victims and the many victims of British state violence in in the in the north. So we're on a reconciliation process. We're on in 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 um, twenty years into a peace process. Okay. Those of us in political leadership should be concentrated on what we can do to actually ensure that we have institutions okay. up and up and running rather than point fingers at others. I'm